Right, just been to the garage to get a few supplies. <sighs> a little tiny quiche, a bottle of Ribena and a little cheese stick. And I'm on the broad track to heading for Brentnall. Um, there's a plaque just back there talking about Joseph of Arimathea and he called this place Paradise. And they had the Paradise Milk Company back there a few years back. And they got a plaque on the wall where it used to be. And uh, this is part of the ancient route, apparently, that he would have taken Joseph of Arimathea if he'd landed up back there with the tide. Um, because there's a strong association, there must be some truth in it, with him going to Glastonbury and everything. This is part of the route that would take you to Glastonbury. So, this is what I'm doing. I've mentioned all before in other videos, but each time I come there's something slightly different. Maybe a new house built, new fence, new view. Like I said, I don't come over here very often now. I find it a bit, I don't know, sentimental, too sentimental going down memory lane too much. No, I don't class this because I didn't really use this when I lived here. Lovely little cottages though, aren't they? Lovely views out the back. Across fields. Beautiful. See those fields over there? Western Super American, see Crooks Peak. Um, and then eventually we come out behind the rugby club. But well, that could have all changed now, see? That could have all changed. Yeah, when you live in a flat, you have to get out. I don't want to sit in a flat all day. That's why I'm out, always out. I mean, I've always wanted to find a place with a garden or a courtyard or a balcony, but nothing's come up yet. I'm hoping it will. It's an opportunity. It's a good way for the opportunity to come along. Might never. I had a lovely house once, a big garden. Enough to park four cars on the drive. That's nice there, isn't it? Yeah, very nice, that. Pretty. We'll get a bit more rural in a minute. We've got an old derelict. Well, it might be not be derelict. There, see? I'm going to take a picture of that in a minute. We've just come up to this old... There's a ditch running down there, by the way. Somebody might still live in that, by the way. Just because it looks derelict don't mean that no one is in it. It needs a lot of work on it, doesn't it? Right, over and out.